Hi, I'm Tati and today I'm doing the reading habits tag. I actually saw this tag on the channel Book Geek Movie Freak and she tagged anyone who wanted to do this tag so I'm going to do it. I'll leave a link to her video and the original tag in the description. And I also wanted to do this tag as my video for reaching 75 subscribers. So thanks to all my subscribers, let's get into the tag. Question one, do you have a certain place at home for reading? For me, this is in anywhere in my room, but usually on my bed. I just like to be comfortable when I'm reading. Question two, bookmark or random piece of paper? Really, it's whatever is next to me that I can just grab at the time when I need a bookmark. So I use both. Question three, can you just stop reading or do you have to stop reading after a certain amount of pages or a chapter? I personally prefer to stop after a chapter if I can. If not, I at least have to read to the end of the page because if not, coming back to read in the middle of a page is really annoying and disorienting. Question four, do you eat or drink while reading? Not really. Usually if I'm really sucked into a story, I forget to do anything else. So usually if I'm reading, I'm just reading. Which leads into my answer for question five. Multitasking, can you watch TV or listen to music while you read? And my answer for that is also no, because when I'm reading, I get so sucked into a book that I can't concentrate on anything else. That includes music or TV. Sometimes I can listen to music that doesn't have any lyrics, but mostly I don't even do that unless I need to block out surrounding noise. Question six is one book at a time or several at once? I actually am someone who reads multiple books at once and I usually read them on different formats. I'll read one book as a physical copy and I'll read another as an ebook and I could also be listening to a different one as an audiobook. This usually helps me keep the books separate in my head and lets me read at different times. Question seven, reading at home or everywhere? I can read and pretty much anywhere, especially with reading on my phone. However, if I have the choice, I really prefer to read at home. Reading out loud or silently in your head? I always read silently because I'm reading to myself and I can read faster that way. Question nine, do you read ahead or even skip pages? I am guilty of this. Sometimes if I'm getting bored in a book, I will skip ahead to where I can see the next big plot point is gonna happen and I will find that and I'll leave a bookmark in it so that I can go back to where I was and see how far I have to go and kind of stay motivated to get to that point. Also, I will sometimes skip over the awkward or embarrassing parts that aren't really vital to the story because secondhand embarrassment. Also, I sometimes do that thing where I skip ahead and read only the dialogue on a page and then I'll go back and read everything in between because I'm afraid I missed something when I skipped ahead and read just the dialogue because I just wanted to know what they were saying. And I kind of even annoy myself when I do that because I feel like I'm spending twice the amount of time to read one page, but I keep doing it. Question 10, breaking the spine or keeping it like new? I never like break a spine on purpose, but there are some paperbacks where it's just unavoidable and I don't really stress over it. Question 11, do you write in your books? No, I usually don't write in my books, not even to put like this book belongs to. If I want to remember quotes from a book, what I'll do is I'll leave a sticky note and then I'll go back when I finish the book and I'll write down all the quotes in a notebook. I just have never really been comfortable with writing in the book. And question 12 is who do you tag? And I'm going to tag anyone who wants to do this tag. Um, you can go ahead and do it and say that I tagged you. And leave me a comment down below and let me know if you do that. You can also let me know in the comments your answers to any of these questions. If you like this video, you can let me know by giving it a like. I try to upload a new video to this channel at least once a week, so subscribe if you want to see more. Ugh, what is it? <laughs>